hanging out here at Manhattan Beach, uh, wrapping up uh, the Cal Cup and the young women in front of me one year ago. 16s champions, this year 18s champions. Avery Bustamante from Redondo on my left. We went through this last time. <laughs> Skylar Caputo on my right uh, from Miracosta. Uh, girls, uh, the, the one, seemingly the one kind of uh, hiccup or, or low point uh, during the day uh, was, was that loss in pool play, but it seemed like it kind of lit a fire under you guys uh, oh, because sure. oh, yeah. we saw a different team after that. Uh, for, first of all, uh, was it just, uh, just a case of kind of just uh, the middle of the day and just n not quite in rhythm yet, or what do we attribute to, uh, to that, that loss early on? I mean, we haven't played together like for a while. For a while. So our, our first match is pretty easy, but our second match it definitely tested our ability. And I mean, it was just a matter of siding out. And after that game, we did not we hate losing. So after losing, like we wanted to win the. There's a lot of fire burning yeah. inside. So yeah, we really wanted to win, and we just like kind of like. That was very, very, very motivating for us, and I think that was actually like a disguise, like a good thing. Yeah. Uh, like I said uh, at the top, 16s champions last year, 18s champions this year. You guys have had super hectic schedules with uh, with, uh, with indoor and, and sand, and sometimes playing not together. Usually uh, uh, playing uh, together. How much does it mean to you guys a year later to be able to come back and, and win this? I mean, it's definitely been a journey, like, this whole year, like, we've become closer friends, like, even though we do go to different schools, it's been a great experience, I mean, I'm more than excited after high school ends, we're going to be playing elite beach volleyball together, and um, up until we go off to college. Uh, April. Uh, the, uh, the, the one thing that I saw uh, from from you guys, I mean, when, when you guys were able to side out and you guys were able to get uh, get passes in, in rhythm and in system, I mean, you guys were so strong at the net. But uh, but the thing that I was uh, impressed with, even above what you guys did at, uh, at West Coast JOs, was uh, was your guys' defense. And especially it seemed after you guys lost that match, like the the last what four matches that you guys played, your defense was uh, was unbelievable. I mean, do you think that's the kind of the the biggest growth in, you, in your guys' games together is your ability to play de uh, play Definitely. defense? Yeah, I think our defense we've just gotten more aggressive and like we've like obviously like through the, out the whole summer we've gotten better with like reading and learning how to yeah read better and I think that's pretty much it and it helped us a lot. Uh, Skylar, uh, I mean having the experience uh, to go over and play internationally and and, and then come uh, come back. Where, where did you see your game elevate to or, or, or grow to yeah. even since the last time you guys played together? What are the things that you're feeling? better about or more confident about or stronger about with your game? I'm um, definitely going overseas like the level of play is a lot higher and I think when we came out here it was nice to play and have that dominating feeling. Um, for sure like our serving went increasingly up today and I think that especially the international serving you have to focus a lot because that's where you score a lot of points over there um, as well as siding out. You have to side out first point. You can't let other teams get a momentum. Okay. I want to switch real, uh, real quick to a couple of indoor questions. April, uh, your team is playing today in the Lakewood tournament. Yeah, we won. You will be Woo! rejoining them no. on, on Wednesday I, uh, I assume. Will you be rejoining them on Wednesday, or not? Yeah, I okay. know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, she's fine. Okay. Uh, so, how uh, obviously huge expectations for you guys this year uh, indoors? Uh, Noreen back, uh, Yasmin back. Uh, just a great supporting cast. Uh, how excited are you about this indoor season? I am very excited. There's nothing more I want than to win CIF. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Got to win league first, right, Skylar? No, we're winning league this year. <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> Uh, but uh, but uh, aside from uh, from from playing Miracost, I mean, you, th you think the pieces uh, are, are there, and, and obviously the motivation is there after Great Oak yeah. last year. Uh huh. I think um, a lot of the girls are the same from last year. We're missing like two or three players, but our team is very solid this year. We have like backup, uh, like super super good. Everyone's like really in depth team, and I think we can be really good. Everything goes as planned. Okay, Skyler. You guys made an awesome run at Ann Kang, you know, yes. when you were getting ready to play. How, uh, how much does that excite you or motivate you to say, you know what, like they went out there and, and performed amazing, and now I'm going to come back, and yeah. we're not only we're going to give them Redondo problems, but hopefully everybody else. Um, I first my first text message, text message overseas was that we beat Los Alamitos, and that a little bit was, of revenge from last year. More than anything I could have asked for. I mean, 
just be able to come back after that loss in the CIF, um, I think, quarterfinals. Yeah. Um, but I'm really excited. We have a roster of 20 girls, 11 seniors, lost like three last year, so it's pretty much the same team. And um, we play our, one of our rivals, not our biggest rival, right. but Marymount tomorrow. Yeah. And and, the, and are you you ready to go? Yes. You, ready, you ready to put the socks and yes. shoes on last, and get back on the hardwood? Last time was indoor players. Right. Uh, what, and the last thing, what does the future hold for you guys uh, beach-wise? I mean, you've accomplished uh, so much. I mean, obviously, I know the focus is on indoor right now in the immediate future, but what, Abra, what, uh, what, what does the future hold uh, for the two of you together beach-wise? When, when might we see you together on the sand again? The whole winter. Yeah. All winter. Okay. I, we want to keep playing like all winter. We want to keep training with the lead and just like continue growing as a team. And, you know, I don't actually know what the future holds. Can we play this tournament next year? Yeah. Yeah, we we'll want to play this tournament next year. <laughs> okay. Go for a three-peat? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, I'm glad that it worked out with your schedules for you guys to qualify. Yes. And obviously, I'm glad that it worked out uh, that the loss was probably the best thing for you guys because as I pan down here once again, holding, uh, holding the hardware for the second year in a row, Abel Bustamante, Skylar Caputo, girls, great job. And try not to beat each, up on, uh, each other too much during indoor. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks.